as your company grows, and if you're using G Suite, which is my preferred method of using email and documents and drives and all that good stuff, it may behoove you to create a group email address so that multiple recipients at your company all receive an email at that note. Whether it's sales at your company name.com or it's customer service at your company name.com. This is a great hack for a variety of reasons. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of my Amazon guy. And in this video, I'm gonna cover how to make a group email address inside of G Suite. First thing you're gonna do is go to gsuite.google.com in the top right, hit the admin console. That'll take you here. In here, click on this group's name. Uh, for privacy reasons, I can't click this next step on camera. So after you click on this group step, you're then gonna hit in the top left, add new group. That'll take you to this blank screen page. In here, you can type in whatever you'd like. So let's just say fake group name. And, you can t and, and this title right here will be public facing. So if you wanted to have this to be customer service or whatever it might be, right? And then on the group email, this is what the actual email address will be. I'm just gonna type in fake at myamazonguy.com. You can select who the group owners are so who can edit people uh, permissions or add other individuals to that email group. Hit next. Inside here, this is the only tricky part of this process. You actually wanna select this publish post icon if you want people external to your organization to be able to email this group. And 99 out of 100 times, that's generally why I'm creating a group email is because I wanna be able to have somebody from outside my organization hit multiple people in my company at the same time without knowing each of our individual email addresses. Or maybe they're a client and they email us every day for a variety of different reasons um, and we've got three people on their account because they're a big account. Well, instead of having to type out all three people's names, they can just simply type in their brand name at myamazonguy.com and we can then service them quicker and more effectively. Um, if you're just an Amazon seller and you're wondering what are the use cases for this? Well, um, I gave a couple in the intro, but basically uh, let's say you have certain teams that do certain aspects and you wanna be able to know, hey, creative at your brand.com, um, all requests for creative or updates go to that email address. But then you want the company owner, the graphic designer and the Amazon um, person in charge of your account to all get those emails. Well, this is a great way to do this. So by selecting the external public publish post, it allows them to email that. And then you can select who can join the group. So anyone in the organization or, um, or you can have it to be invite only. You can make it private. A lot of different options there. Once you do that, just in the bottom right of that previous screen, hit add group. And then it brings you to this screen. And then here you can hit what members to add to the group. That'll take you to this screen and you can hit this plus symbol to decide which members to add. That'll pull up this screen when you hit that yellow plus sign and you can start typing people's names in or their email addresses and then simply hit add to group. You're done, hit save and exit. Uh, you can send a test email. Um, the best way to send a test email is generally from somebody outside the domain, then they email that, that, that new group you made. And then if everybody gets it, boom, you're in business. This is one of my favorite hacks. I'm a big believer in the Google ecosystem. Um, it's really, really helpful. G Suite's very affordable, um, fastest email platform. It uses Gmail to log in. A lot, a lot of benefits to it. So hopefully this is helpful. If you have other um, Google hacks you like to use to help you out as an Amazon seller or a business owner, please post them in the comments. All right, my name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy. If you need other Amazon consulting, check us out at myamazonguy.com.